Hey everyone, I'm in Liberty State Park in Jersey City, New Jersey, and I'm headed to a new virtual geocache that was just made here. And it's at a site that means a lot to a lot of people who live here in New Jersey and New York and the whole area. So it's gonna be a quick video, but I wanted to show you. So come along with me. This is the spot of the virtual geocache I went to find. It's called the Empty Sky 9-11 Memorial, and it has all of the victims' names written on two long walls. It's just a beautiful, moving tribute to all those that we lost. Everyone, while I'm here, I just wanted to give you a quick tour of the other sites you could see here at Liberty State Park if you've never been or you're thinking about coming here. Uh, it's filled with history, it's really cool, and I wanted to show it off a little bit. This is the Central Railroad Terminal of New Jersey. It was built in 1889 and was in operation until 1967. They estimate that over 10.5 million people came through this terminal after landing in Ellis Island, which I'm going to show next. Um, it's a beautiful building. Unfortunately, it got pretty damaged in Hurricane Sandy. so. I was very happy to find that when I came to visit now they had it reopened and they were actually using the inside to sell ferry tickets to see the Statue of Liberty but it's just a gorgeous building, um, it's, it's just every detail is worth noticing. This is a distant view of Ellis Island where over 12 million immigrants came through to enter the United States. This was the U.S.'s busiest immigration station from 1892 to 1954 and afterwards many of those immigrants would go to the railroad terminal that I just showed you to get to their final destinations. And of course I couldn't leave without showing unfortunately another distant view but a view nonetheless of the Statue of Liberty. Thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video.